Today we check out how to make this glowing neon text effect here in Photoshop. All right, so I'm going to go with this composition that I made previously and I'm going to uncheck it. And the first thing we're going to need to do is darken up the background because basically this is going to be a glowing neon light. So I'm going to select the background. I'm going to go to the adjustments, select the curves and I'm going to bring it down, increase the contrast. I'm going to go down, click on solid color, make it black. Click OK. I'm going to decrease the opacity to somewhere around 70. And I'm going to press and hold shift select both of these layers. Press Ctrl G to group them. I'm going to rename it dark and I'm going to add a mask. And we're going to need to lighten up this area where basically the text is going to be. So I'm going to select the brush tool. Make sure that you're on the black. And I'm going to decrease the opacity somewhere around 30, 35 ish. And all I need to do is just click in these areas to lighten up. And from here, I'm going to double click on the text. It's going to open up the layer style. If you're not on white, then you can click on color overlay and choose white. And from here, I'm going to go to the stroke and I'm going to add a little bit of stroke somewhere on two, make it black, put it into the center and also decrease the opacity quite a bit. Let's click on the outer glow, change the color. I'm going to go with some orange, click OK. And I'm going to change the blend mode to linear dodge add, decrease the opacity somewhere around 50. And I'm going to push the size all the way up. Also click on the thumbnail of the contour and I'm going to push it up to be even more brighter. Click OK. Let's go to the drop shadow and I'm going to decrease the opacity somewhere around 20 ish. Change the blend mode to linear light. I'm going to decrease the size and click OK. Let's press J to duplicate the layer and let's double click on the top layer. I'm going to uncheck the stroke and I'm going to activate the inner glow and I'm going to change up the color to some darker orange. Click OK. Let's change the blend mode to hard light. I'm going to decrease the opacity. The size is pretty good. The choke, I'm going to decrease that. And I'm also going to change the contour to this one or stronger contrast. Maybe decrease the choke a little bit more. OK, now let's go to the outer glow. And I can increase the opacity even more, somewhere around 80. And I'm going to go down with the size quite a bit. I might also decrease the noise a little bit more. Let's go to drop shadow. And I'm going to go to blend mode, normal. Increase the opacity somewhere around 40-ish. I'm going to decrease the distance. Increase the spread and the size as well. I'm also going to adjust the inner glow a little bit. Decrease the choke, the size. Click OK. So this was it. Thanks for watching.